Hi everyone, I'm sitting inside of this Land Rover Discovery Sports 2018 model now, which is a brand new one. And the reason for today's video is that this is actually our second time ever we installing our product on this vehicle. So obviously the first time was uh, testing our modules. So back then we were going through lots of issues and just because uh, of first timers. But now today we install an Apple CarPlay into the factory system which is a 10.2 inch meridian sound system and just wanted to show you how the apple carplay worked out and how it gets displayed on the factory screen just a video that shows that apple carplay integration is definitely doable on this factory audio of the land rover that through our product so i'll just briefly show you how the system works and so at the moment the installation is almost finished, we're just cleaning up and finalizing all. So there's currently a CarPlay module of ours being connected to factory head unit. And also there's an iPhone being connected to the USB cable as well. In order to bring Apple CarPlay to factory screen, all you gotta do is press and hold up the voice command button. If you press and hold it for a second, it switched to the Apple CarPlay mode straight away. I'll just change the brightness for a bit. And point. Now, just like any other CarPlay, it will bring up those apps from your iPhone, whether it's iPhone 6, iPhone 7, or iPhone X, or even iPhone 8 that came out recently. It will be still compatible, and you can just use a screen to touch around control the apps and the features. Just like standard CarPlay, it also supports voice command to the Siri as well. So when you say, hey Siri, your iPhone picks up the voice. Take me to the nearest petrol station. The nearest one I found is BP on Dawson Street in Brunswick West. Want to try that one? Yes. Getting directions to BP. Just like that, it responds to your voice command and brings up suitable action. In this case, it used the Apple map navigation. Head west on the route, then turn right onto Henkel Street. Yeah, so that was the Apple map navigation usage. And with that same message, you can also ask it to play music or phone call as well. So when you say, hey Siri. Call Robert. Calling Robert. Hi, it looks like you don't have enough credit to make this call. Just like that, it receives the voice command to the phone and makes a phone call to the phone app as well. So apart from that, you can pretty much do most of action to the Siri as well, apart from the touching the screen. As long as the app is compatible with Apple CarPlay and you know what you're doing, you shouldn't have any problem with it. Whether it's the Spotify, TuneIn Radio, phone message, now playing, which we mainly use for digital radio. On sex abuse allegations against another priest, the Archbishop is the most senior Catholic in the world to be found guilty of concealing abuse, which occurred that's pretty grim news. Yep, so that's the Apple CarPlay retrofit on 10.20 Meridian sound system, which was installed on this 2018 Land Rover Discovery Sports. And also, now you are looking at an Android order currently being displayed on the same screen. So, the CarPlay system we provide, it actually also supports Android Auto as well for a certain vehicle and certain integration module we use. So it's now using the same module as a Apple CarPlay. And actually, I'm filming this video with the iPhone that was connected to the CarPlay just for a sec. And there's now my Samsung Galaxy being connected. So, same goes to Apple CarPlay, it will bring up those compatible Android Auto apps onto the screen. And 
Just like Siri, it also uses the Google Voice command as well, which you can either use that mic button when you touch it, or when you say, OK Google, take me to Doncaster Westfield. Navigating to Westfield, Doncaster. Just like that, it responds to your voice as well, and it executes with those apps that compatible. In this case, it used the Google Maps to execute my command, which was to navigate me to Doncaster Westfield, which I literally need to go soon. So yeah, that's the end of the You are on the fastest route despite some traffic. You should reach your destination by 2.59 p.m. There we go. And with that same method, you can also ask it to play some music as well. So when you say, OK, Google, play me a music by Flyleaf. Here you go, asking to play Flyleaf. for the Android order, which is being installed with the Apple CarPlay into the same vehicle, the one package.